Hey guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can reset the BIOS password or the security password on your HP Compact Computer DC 7800. So first, before we can do anything, we need to switch off the computer. Next, you need to remove the power cable. So unplug the power cable. Then on the side here, there is a button. You need to press on it to open the top. There is also another one on the other side. And then remove the top cover. Okay, in here you need to lift up the power box or the power supply. Now remember to unplug the power cable. And in here there is a green jumper that you need to pull out where it says password. So I'm just gonna zoom in so you can see. Right here, this one right here, you need to pull it out, like so. And then, then now we're going to put the power supply back down. We need to plug it in. Plug in the power and turn on the computer. Okay, so I'm going to bring the keyboard over, just for now. And the computer will boot up and it will try to perform a memory check. Now on the keyboard we can press on the F10 key to go into setup. Still trying to do a memory check. Just wait for that to finish. Okay, so it seems like it has already reset it. So we need to press on the F1 to save changes. And again we need to press on the F10 key quickly. And that's it. So you can see now it has been reset back to the default. And that's it. So now we have successfully removed the security uh, password. So in here you can go ahead and set up a new password if you have forgotten the old password already. You can also set up the set up password or power on password. And that's it guys. So now we can go back to file. You can also set up the date and time in here. So I'm going to press on the F10 to save, and then go down save changes and exit. Okay, so now we need to put this jumper back in. And so I just need to put the jumper back in. there so I just need to push it back in remember this one here where it said password and now we put the power supply back down and we need to put the cover back on now we can plug the power cable back in put the monitor up and here the computer will start up. And that's it guys. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.